Hi, welcome to the Passion Experience Podcast. My name is Tracy. You can find me as Schnüffelt here on Ravelry and Instagram. And today I am finally filming my December favorites video. So it's been a rough start of the year for me. I've been sick since before New Year's and I'm still having a little bit of a cold, but I am way better, like really way, way better. So I'm finally filming some videos again because I also have something else that I want to film and my next podcast and yeah so let's get started. I have my list of the things that I want to talk about for December and I'm just going to show everything that I can show. Now the favorite work in progress is my Felici scarf. I'm still working on it. I finished the first two skeins. There are some dangling ends here and it is quite big already so I really like it. I'm gonna knit the two remaining skeins into this completely I think. Maybe I will um, le leave enough for some squares for my blanket but this is my favorite work in progress and I really didn't do a good job at showing it. So here it is. It's like the Noro striped scarf just with two different colorways of Knit Picks Felici yarn. So, favorite work in progress. My favorite finished object for December is Sunny the Snowman and I made him for my son for Christmas and he looks horrible because he's been loved and played and with. I mean, so this is Sunny the Snowman. As you can see, right here, my son kissed him after he ate a chocolate covered uh, gingerbread. So this this cutie pie needs a wash. But yeah, that's my favorite finished object of the month. The pattern is by Susan Claudino and I got it gifted from a lovely viewer of the podcast. So I knit him up and I adore him. <coughs> Sorry. Favorite yarn for December is my Christmas gift from Lori and Grace. It's this beautiful skein of yarn. And the colors today are amazing, which is weird because we are having a snowstorm, but okay. So this yarn is my favorite for December. I'm not going to tell you what it's called because I am not able to. That's the name. And it is just beautiful. So that's the favorite yarn for December. And I'm going to wind this up really soon and I will knit something to go around my neck because it's a 100% superwash merino and I like to have a nylon content for my socks as I'm very hard on socks. <coughs> Sorry. Yeah. Favorite book. It's not a new book, it's an old one and it is Cascadia. It was um, done by Cooperative Press and it has a lot of different patterns in it and I just took it out in December and decided that I want to knit two sweaters out of this really, really soon. Excuse my hair. It's awful. But, uh, yeah. So, what I want to knit first is this sweater. It's the Beacon Hill sweater by Jane Richmond. And I also want to knit, I think the Brit Britannia is the name, by Tin Can Knits. Yes. So this one will be on the needles in spring, I think. So Cascadia is my favorite knitting book for the month of December. Favorite pattern is the Find Your Fate Shawl that I really want to start, but I have so many things going that I just don't feel like starting something new. And also it's everywhere right now. And I normally don't do those bandwagon things, but I really like that shawl a lot. And um, I think I want to use Saxer Rock Lightweight because I have quite a big stash of that, uh, of that and I'm not using it for socks because of what I just told you. I like to have a nylon content and that doesn't have one. So I think I'm going to go through my stash of that and try to find some yarns that I like. If I don't find something in there, I will most likely just not knit it and be done. I don't have a favorite tool for the months of December because I, because I didn't use anything really because I was sick all the time. Now, on to sewing. My favorite sewing FO, favorite sewing pattern, and my favorite sewing uh, fabric are all one thing. And it is the Tilly and the Buttons Clio that I have positioned behind me. 
this is the version that I made and uh, I love it. It's my favorite pattern for December. It's also the not the only one I use because I made the sweater for my dad, which turned out great, but I have to change some things about, uh, on that. So um, yeah, the Tilly and the Buttons Cleo is the favorite pattern. My favorite Evo and this fabric down here. Oh, great. The fabric down here, please unfreeze because this is so not flattering. Okay. The fabric down here is my favorite fabric for the month. It's just adorable. And I do have some some left and I will make the two bags that I promised people that I will make. So this is going to happen soon. Okay. Now, that's it about the sewing. Now, um, favorite event. I didn't have anything. I did have in my local knitting club where I was um, starting to have a tendonitis and I wasn't able to knit. So that was not really a favorite day of mine. <laughs> um, for a favorite podcast, there were a lot of people doing Vlogmas in December and I kept up with two. And that were um, Gab Dashery. She has a sewing vlog and kittenish behavior and she also has a sewing vlog so um those are the only two that i really kept up with and i also try to watch the inside number 23 every day but i didn't so yeah sorry that's just i i couldn't make it happen for favorite show i have two things this month and they're both not team wolf amazing right so um while i was sitting here in my room with my arms not functioning I was watching stuff because that's the only thing I could do so I watched Grimm I finished season one and watched season two and I really enjoy it and to change things up I watched Rizzoli and Isles seasons one and two and I really like both of these shows that's why I have them on DVD because if I like something I get it so I can watch it over and over again because that's just who I am now okay didn't listen to an audiobook I did not really read. I'm still reading the weird um, Hollywood headlines book and I'm not, I'm still not liking it, but I'm going to finish because I'm almost done. The favorite geekery. This is very special this month. I received a necklace for Christmas from my nephew, for one of my nephews. I have five of them. <laughs> And uh, the second oldest, he's 16, and he gave me this necklace for Christmas. And I squealed like I really did. This is the Argent Crest. It is the necklace that Allison wears in Team Wolf. And uh, yeah, now it's mine. It was a Christmas gift, and I adore it. <coughs> now, only two things left. Favorite food. I devoured this package. I have some left because I wanted to savor them, uh, save them. I ordered more and they still haven't arrived. Over two weeks. I've been waiting for these. I love them. I like After Eight, but these are way better. And the best thing, my husband doesn't like those. So they are all mine. Favorite drink. I drank tea. I've been, like I said, basically sick since the beginning of December. And I've been drinking a lot of tea, mainly um, herbal teas. And what I just do, I use a big pot. I put in one bag of chamomile, one bag fennel, and one bag peppermint. And that's my tea. I always like that. So yeah, that's what I've been drinking mostly. And I am back into drinking coffee because I'm back into tasting stuff. So that's it for my December favorites video. And my camera is just hating me today. I don't know why, but oh well. I will hopefully get back to you tomorrow or the day after with my year in review of 2016 and my goals for 2017. And yeah, then it's back to business as usual. You know, hopefully a weekly podcast schedule. We'll see. Okay. Now, I hope you all have a wonderful week and a wonderful few days until I talk to you again and enjoy everything you do. Bye.